Okie dokie man, I'm in the track cutter on the 830 and you can see that's the ground right there, that's ground level. So anytime you look down and your tracks are right there, you're at full tilt. I'm gonna tilt me back to where I would be leveled out if I was on, let me put the spoon down so I'm gonna flip over backwards or something. That would not be good. I'm gonna ruin Derek's seat. Going back, good God. All right, this is a little over 30% slope right here. Just a little bit more than 30%. So, this rock bank right here, get my head up. Anytime you're all the way over like that and those track, you're looking at the tracks right there. You're, you're, you're what I call full, see there's the other one right there, you're full tilt. And then when you spin around this way then, it's nothing but air, man. Nothing but air. If you cut a tree, and you're reached out and it takes you a long it takes you a good while to get to where that don't scare the crap out of you because you know most time when you're stretched out you, you fear you're gonna you're gonna rock or tip or something but anytime you're overlooking that much area like that you're on up in the air and then these are uh, these are big trees here that we're cutting to but we are almost done up here on this job where we're at. So I'll fix the track around, get on the, uh, that was cut with a rubber tire machine right there. I'll fix to get over on the other side of that and cut the rest of those pines on that, on that slope up through there. But this machine is like, it's like, it's like being in a tank or something. I mean, it just, the way it feels, the way it operates all that and everything it just it's it's wild man and just a just a sheer how much it weighs you know why it sticks on these hills the way it does and, and uh it's pretty cool but you guys that run these track cutters all the time man i'm gonna tell you in the steep ground not in not necessarily in the swamps but in the steep ground man it takes it, it takes the right person to run these things i mean it I doubt I'll ever be as good as Derek is. And I don't know that I ever want to be as good as Derek is. But these these things are so tricky to run, man. And in the hands of a master, I mean, you can make these things do just some crazy, crazy stuff. And it's so much different than cutting than cutting with a uh, a rubber tire machine, man. It's just completely different. I mean, even handling these uh, these these great old big trees and everything. I don't have my camera mount to hold my camera, but cutting these great old big trees, gosh, it's just so different. The first day we were on these big pines here, man, I was about to cry trying to figure out, because I couldn't balance them, man. I could not, I could not, because I mean, I cut them, and I mean, they were just, they were basically doing whatever they wanted to. And so I thought, I went home and I thought about it and thought about it and tried to figure out what, how I could do it to, to, you know to get them to balance and all that stuff and oh shit but uh i finally i finally got that figured out man it took me a while but i need to throw so much brush out of the way so i'm gonna put this camera down we'll see y'all later